<laughs> Dean, not the way you really wanted to finish 2014, but a tough old game out there today. Yeah, it was a tough old game. Uh, I, I think it was improvement in terms of our performance from last week. Um, in the first half, we, we probably had the better of things. We probably won those crucial moments, and as the game went on, um, we, we, we lost those, really, in, in reality, in the second half. Uh, we sort of came out, started well, um, capitalised, but, you know, we spent a lot... Of, if we look at it, we spent quite a bit, a lot of time in their 22 throughout the game and, and didn't get a lot of pay from it. Um, we probably lost lost the breakdown battle and, and as the game went on we lost the, the set piece battle. So uh, you, you can't beat top four sides like that, um, giving them access into the game like we did in the second half. But it was an epic game and uh, you can take positives from it, certainly taking into next week. Yeah, I think we can. I mean, as I said, it was definitely a step forward from, from us last week um, in, in terms of contact. Um, our, our defensive contact was, was pretty good, actually, so um, he seemed to enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, like you say, coming to Bath, they are going to be a side that are going to be there or thereabouts come the end of the season. And, uh, you know, there, w there will be plenty that you'll look at and say, yeah, we did all right here today. And there'll be bits that you'll pick into and, and be quite negative about yourself. Yeah, I mean, I think so. I mean, I, I'd say a, a turning point was that turnover line out where we ended up drive from just outside the 22. So, I, I mean, that's we, we probably weren't as good on turnovers as we have been previously, um, and, and they're crucial areas, particularly with a quality defensive side like Bath. Um, they're, your, they're your opportunities to get points, and yeah, you know, there are areas, and I, I think we can be proud of our effort and, and proud of the endeavour. We just got to tighten up on the detail, which will allow us to, to build some, some more pressure in the game. Gloucester next week, a packed house at Sandy Park is probably a lovely way to start 2015. Yeah, what a, what a great one. We'll be very pleased to get home. Um, huge game against um, yeah, a, a vastly improving Gloucester side. So it's a it's a big game for us. It really is um, it really is must win. So yeah, you know, we're, we're comfortable to put some pressure on us to come come home. Uh, it'd be lovely to be home in front of the fans, and um, yeah, I, I think we should expect a performance. 2014. When you look back at it, Dean, it's been quite a year for the club, and uh, a lot, a lot of highlights. Probably the biggest being the LV Cup win. Yeah, I think so. You look back, it, it's been a reasonable year. I mean, there's certainly been yeah so much development in in, in terms of the club. Um, we won our first yeah senior title. Um, yeah, we, we started very well in this year's Premiership, uh, as well as the other competitions were sitting nicely. And then there's the, the redevelopment of Sandy Park as well. So there's, there's a lot to talk about and what's been done in, in 2014. But let's uh, let's see what we can get and see what we can chase in 2015. I was going to say, what what, what are the aims now for 2015? The club is on the up, isn't it? Yeah, I, I think so. I mean, it's important to keep going. I mean, yeah. um, momentum in, in in a game as a, as a club is all very important to, to, to maintaining ambition and, and we're an ambitious club and so we'll look to do that but you know I, I think I think we're banging in the first two games and and particularly next week and, and then we can start to reassess and, and really set some goals but if we don't uh, if we don't work hard and we don't you know put it lay down a couple of performances particularly next week then um, yeah we might not have the opportunity.